It's been an incredibly eventful summer for air travel and challenging circumstances. While the global IT meltdown was probably the most significant occurrence, there was a multi-day ordeal a week prior, affecting JetBlue travelers in Paris. What was supposed to be a mere eight-hour flight was actually a lengthy three-day ordeal as a 10-month-old A321LR encountered issues. Let's explore this incident for today's video. A JetBlue Airbus A321LR was forced to divert twice as it attempted to cross the Atlantic Ocean on a flight from Paris, France to New York on July 11th and July 12th. The aircraft finally left Europe on July 14th. Flight Radar 24 data showed that the aircraft, registered as November 4076 Juliet, was operating flight 61908 from Paris Charles de Gaulle to New York JFK on July 11th. As it began crossing the Atlantic Ocean over Flying Island to the west, pilots made the decision to return to Charles de Gaulle. This flight to nowhere took a little under three and a half hours. One of the passengers on board the flight, Laurie Kilmartin, tweeted her experience on social media, saying that the aircraft turned around due to the failure of the aircraft fuel quantity indicator, resulting in the pilots not knowing how much fuel was left. After having returned to Paris, the aircraft was scheduled to fly out of the airport on July 12th. However, as the aircraft departed on its second attempt from Paris to JFK, it diverted once again, this time to Dublin Airport. JetBlue provided the following statement to Simple Flying about the ordeal, saying, On Thursday, July 11th, JetBlue Flight 1908, with service from Paris to New York, returned to Paris after our pilots received an indication of a potential issue with the aircraft's fuel management and distribution system. Maintenance teams addressed the issue, and the flight was rescheduled for Friday, July 12th. Unfortunately, shortly after takeoff, the same indication reappeared. Our pilots and operations team decided it would be best to turn back and land safely in Dublin. Customers were reaccommodated on other flights and fuel refunds and future travel were issued as a token of our sincere gratitude for their patience. As always, we will comply with any relevant passenger compensation regulations. So, it sounds like passengers were put on other flights out of Dublin to get to their destination. As for the incident aircraft, it left Dublin for JFK on July 14th. The A321LR isn't all that old. In fact, it was delivered to JetBlue on September 28, 2023. And being less than a year old, the aircraft had accumulated just 2,911 flight hours and 428 flight cycles as of June. At the time of this video's production in late August, it appears that the jet has been incident-free ever since. What are your thoughts on this incident and how it was handled by the airline? Let us know by leaving a comment. In addition to our daily YouTube videos, Simple Flying publishes over 150 articles every week. If you're looking for the latest aviation news and insights, visit simpleflying.com.